Hello, this is Arlen. Welcome to today's podcast. Hey, today I want to show you how to create a design workspace in Apple's iWork Pages. A lot of us like to design things, Christmas cards or newsletters or whatever, and having the right design workspace makes everything a lot easier. So let me show you how I do it. I'm going to start Pages. Command space bar is one of the easiest ways to launch applications, so that's what I use. All right, welcome to Pages. I'm just going to close this. And I'm going to go to Page Layout, like a blank layout, and a blank canvas. Double click on that, and that opens up. I'm going to slide this over to the side for a little bit. And what I want to do is I want to open fonts, colors, and the inspector. <clears throat> Basically everything I'm going to need when I'm designing things. So let me move this in over. And all I want to do is arrange these panels so that I have easy access to them. And then I'm going to just leave them there and forget about it. Okay, there we have it. <clears throat> I like this because I, I can preview all of my fonts up here. Take a look at you know what the fonts are, choose typeface, and then the font size. Then I can come down here and choose some colors. Uh, I happen to like the uh, web safe colors because I do a lot of uh, web design and then here you have your inspector so you can go through all of your different options as you're designing something okay the last thing I like to do is down here uh, this little box will allow you to resize your window I just like to resize it a little bit like that and then I come down here to the zoom and then I fit the width Okay. I do that because I'm working on a laptop, so I don't have a whole lot of screen real estate. I don't have a lot of screen space, so I just want to maximize what I have. If you're on a iMac or a, a larger display, then you're going to have a lot more room to play, a lot more room to uh, stretch your project out. Okay, and basically that's it. Now I can create text boxes, move those things around type some text here. This is my text box. Okay, and if I want to change the color on that, just click a few times to highlight it. And then I can take a look at my colors. Okay, I might want to put in some shapes. Like a rounded rounded rectangle. Choose that. Change the color fill. Uh, maybe I want a uh, more yellowish. Where's yellow? Okay, yellow. I'll just drag that into this box there. Change the color. Uh, the stroke on the outside. Maybe I want to make this like a picture frame. Something like that. <clears throat> okay. And you can see I have all my tools here that I'll, I'll need to design. And it makes things really simple. Hope you enjoyed this tip and have fun creating and designing in Apple's iWork pages.